and light. Hey, hi, hello. How are you doing today? Uh, this beautiful August day in Quebec City. It is amazingly beautiful day. I mean, the sun, it's warm. It's, it's just the perfect vacation day. Um, I just finished a, a recode. I just dumped out a recode that I had with my mentor, Christopher Duncan. And um, so we were talking about parts personalities and how they're keeping it stuck. And um, so did you ever wonder why uh, you're maybe not getting the success that you're, you're dreaming of in your life? So whatever success means to you, I mean, it's, it's you know, losing the weight. It's uh, say, hey, hi, hello. I see there's a person that's live. You can leave a comment down below. Uh, I'd love to know who's there um, or leave a heart if you like this. So, I mean, it, you know, it could be like releasing the weight, like I was saying, or you're trying, I mean, with COVID, it's, it's super, uh, super cool during COVID because online businesses have, has been really booming. It's the place to be. It's not time to be, you know, brick and mortar. It's time to be online. And so did, did, did you make, did you succeed making the money that you wanted? Are you in the, the dream relationship that you've been wanting? Um, so are you getting that success or that, that thing that you want in your life? And, and if not, if, if you're like observing other people with that success that you desire, why aren't you, are, aren't you getting it? It's, it's not because there, you don't have talent. It's not because you don't have the desire to have it. It's not because you're not motivated. I mean, you try and try and try. Um, it's not that uh, you're not a hard worker. It's not that you're not in the right time and place. Uh, it's not that you don't have the willpower. It's not your fault. I mean, you've tried everything and it's not working. Then why is it that uh, you're not getting what you want? Why is that? And the most frustrating part is sometimes you look around and other people, other people are. And then you think it's because of you. It's not. It's not because of you. It's not your fault. There are old voices that, that we're not even conscious of that are just running the show. So if you don't experience what you want in life, it's just because of old patterns. Remember, your outside reality is, is, is kind of like a movie. So you know how you, you go to a movie theater and so you have the movie coming out of the projector and it's projecting that on the screen. Your life is the screen and what's in there is the projector. So if you're not seeing what you want in your life, it's because there's something in there that is playing it out on your screen. And Bruce Lipton says it, like that's epigenetics. And he says that your life will absolutely reflect your beliefs. Your unconscious mind will do everything in its power to have it match. So it's giving you precious information. And so we have different parts of us. You know how we have like, like the perfectionist, the overachiever, uh, the lazy person, the caring person. You know, we have like different aspects of ourselves. And, but we have some that are not serving us anymore. It's, uh, and these, these like, these part-time personalities or these aspects of us are running the show. They're running old programs. It's like a darn CD player that you didn't like when you were a teenager that's still playing. And you have no control over it. It's really an unconscious pattern. And it's trying to keep you safe. It just keeps you in the what it thinks it's possible. And, and it, that's what keeps you stuck so it has nothing to do with you. It's just all programming. And Dr. Lipton really compares the unconscious mind as a CD. And what's on there is just engraved there. It's going to play and play and play and play until you scratch it or until you just engrave something different. And that, that explains why, you know, how sometimes you have like some, some people that like are big lottery winners. And uh, after a few months or a few years, they just lose it all. They lose it all because they have a pattern that's telling them that having money is unsafe. And so they just overspend and overspend and then nothing's left. 
And some, sometimes they're even worse off than before they won. And so the same thing happens for athletes, you know, like uh, basketball players or baseball players where they win like millions of, they earn millions of, of dollars every year. And then when comes after they're, they're finished playing and they're retired, I mean, they end up completely broke. And that was my problem where I, you know, I, I made money, I lost money. I started a business, I lost the business. It was always oscillating between the two because I had some core wounds related with money. So my parents used to fight about it all the time. Um, they never had enough. And my, daddy used, my dad used to overspend it. And that's what I learned. I learned that money was unsafe. I learned that I had to be really intelligent to, to have money. Uh, but I, I learned also that those who have money are thieves. And so that was all underlying in my subconscious mind that was playing all the time. So every time I had money, things happened in my life to, so that I, I just didn't have it anymore. Extra bills, um, you know, car broke down, uh, all sorts of crap. Just to prove my beliefs, my underlying beliefs to be true. And that's, that's really, really a bitch. <laughs> And so, but we have a way that we can reprogram that. So what we do in, in our coaching with our clients, we have, so we don't, we don't wake up at 5 a.m. and we don't do affirmations and we don't do I am's and we don't write things over and over and over again to try to change what's engraved on the, on the CD. This is 2021. There are different ways of doing things. So we connect to what we call your superconscious, which is the the part of you that coded all of the instructions that are you and we recode that and so the recode i just did before i hop on the live was we were giving a promotion to those part-time personalities that were not serving me anymore and since they're they did a great job not serving me they're going to do a great job serving me so that is, it's, it's really freaking amazing. It really, and then your behavior changes like that. So, so that's really, really cool. Uh, there are a few videos that I did put on the page. If you want to go check it out, Chris Duncan, my mentor, he has one where, uh, he, he actually takes, does this pro a process with two women who are afraid of, of public speaking and, uh, check out their reaction at the end. I mean, it's, it's really, really awesome. Uh, if you're at all intrigued, you want to see this kind of new revolutionary type of coaching, uh, I have also on this page uh, a post where I put a link uh, that you can come and join me on Zoom and we can do a recode session together. I uh, hope this was, uh, this was helpful. At least to understand that it's not your fault. It's just a program, so it's a CD that's playing in there over and over again. And uh, it's a vibration that you're used to, even if you there's a part of you that doesn't like it. It's a vibration that you're used to, so it always goes back to that default mode until you do something about it. And we know that now there's an easy way to do that. So have yourself a great rest of your day. Uh, and enjoy yourself, and uh, we'll see each other soon. Bye, you guys.